What's going on, folks? This is Marion L. Bones Jr., a.k.a. L.B. The Realist. Checking in. I'm here with my beautiful family. There goes my beautiful wife, Angel, right over there. And our granddaughter, Isla. We're getting some family time in today because we figure she's in front of the screen. She's having way too much screen time. And, you know, that's probably having a, a, a negative effect on her brain development. So we decided she needs to get out, get some fresh air. You know what I'm saying? Come to the park. We're in a nice... It's a closed area at uh, John F. Kennedy Park in El Cajon, California. They got a school right back there, so you got some kids over there making noise in PE. And we're just enjoying the weather, enjoying the sunlight, enjoying our time. Say hi, beautiful wife. Hello, hello. There she goes. There they go. And we've been out here. She's just been doing laps. All she want to do is just run around, run around the whole field. We walked around the whole field already. She wasn't interested. She was interested in some swings for a little bit. And it, it got too extreme for her, so she was like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> Let me see if I can, I don't think I can switch the camera around, huh? I'm not sure if I can switch the camera around, but I'll do this for you. So hopefully you guys can see me. Um, I got some interviews and some meetings that I need to schedule for, um, for some different brokerages. I want to talk to Compass Realty. I want to talk to Remax. I want to talk to Century 21 um also exp so i'll be scheduling some meetings throughout this week and i'll be really uh solidifying my position and and coming to a close on who i want to hang my license under my real estate license so that is going to be this week hopefully uh, i shouldn't say hopefully i should say when uh, my wife is ready she will join me and we will start our real estate husband and wife team and you know we will recruit other people and really build our brand, build our team, our organization, our, our systems and our structure. And hopefully one day, one of my big dreams or one of my big goals, I should say, is to help other people uh, realize their, their entrepreneur and their real estate and their business, you know, help them real, realize their, their, their gifts, I should say, you know, realize their full potential in real estate and business investing but in order for me to be a, a real authority figure on that kind of thing, you know, I got to make it myself, you know, so that's what I'm focused on right now, building generational wealth that I can not only enjoy myself, but pass down to, you know, my, my son, my granddaughter, you know, my granddaughter's granddaughters and grandsons and grandchildren. You know, that's one thing that some people don't realize. They feel to realize that my family doesn't have wealth. We don't have any assets. I'm starting to acquire assets in my life now at the age of 33, but you know, my mom didn't have assets. My dad didn't have assets. They didn't have anything to pass off to me like that. So I'm building everything myself. It starts with me. So not only am I trying to build a life for myself, but I'm trying to build a life for my family. I'm trying to make sure that one day, one day soon, actually I'll be able to give my mother a house of her own, you know, give my wife a house and um, we'll be able to pass up something to our kids and our kids' kids. And you know, we're not gonna teach them to be spoiled or anything like that. We're gonna teach them the value of a dollar, the value of hard work, the value of consistency and persistency and having a dream bigger than you know, just the norm. So that's what I'm working on, folks. Um, pretty soon I will have my brokerage picked and I will start my real estate career. Um, like I said, I'm leaning towards just building up my own brand, building up my own team structure, you know, under under the uh, mentorship and the um, the guidance of Keller Williams as a brokerage overall. And I think I could really um, I think I could really strive or I could really uh, thrive in that kind of environment because I know exactly what I want to do and I know exactly who I am and what kind of work I'm going to put in. So that's it, folks. I'm hoping everybody out there as well. If not, I'm sincerely hoping you do better. Take the time out to enjoy yourself. Take the time out to come to a park and just take in the scenery, you know, take in the fresh air, take in the sunlight, grab a soccer ball like we did and just kick around the soccer ball, you know, get some baseball bats and a baseball and come out to the, come out to the field and hit a few rounds, you know, just enjoy life. Remember to take the time to enjoy the small things. And, you know, even though we're, you know, bombarded with commercials and, materialism and nonsense just remember that it's the memories and the people and the love that we share the feelings that we share 
that matter the most. Until next time, folks, love, peace, and light. Remember, be kind, rewind. And until next time, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.